And we are back. Hope everyone is having a good weekend so far. It is Saturday and we have an HDC. It is another scrimmage for this week. Uh, hopefully the campaign will start next week. Uh, but had some uh, administrative things that had to get resolved. So uh, we have an Anderson's counterattack. Uh, current server pop is 249. Uh, right now, 130 on the CSA, so a little uh, against 119 on the Union, so a little bit of an imbalance here, 11. I think SR is supposed to be jumping over uh, to the Union side, so hopefully that'll uh, help uh, fix some of that problem. But they are live, so we'll kind of just go through here and look at all the Union commanders. So for the Union, we have Coco leading the 20th, Knight leading the 8th PA. Then we have 19th led by One Army, MWB by Diggy. 4th West Virginia by Henry. IVB under Sebi and Jeff Knight. Orcutt leading the 42nd PA along with Williams. And that is it for the Union team. Now on the CSA team we got 9th Corps under Tommy. 83rd under Tiberius. TB under Bocephus. NYV under Parker. HL under Wilkes and Grinch. And HD under Rob and Waffen. Um, let's see. We also have Ricks in here from the 79th. And there's Targary. So he moved over um, for the SR. So uh, still 10-man inbound. Eh, nine man. That's not too bad. Plus, I think my number's into the CSA column. So a little bit imbalanced, but not bad at all. Um, so I'll have to keep an eye on. Hopefully that... Uh, yeah, yes. Now it's 7. We're fine. Um, so it looks like the Union is... We're live at the start here, that's why I kind of did the intro that way. And the Union is already pulling back um, quite far. So they're going to opt for kind of defending in that far corner there, close to their spawn. Um, the CSA is still getting moved out here. There they go, they're starting to roll. So again, uh, just a quick orientation for the map. You got the CSA spawn is right there. Uh, point of contention is right here. It's actually quite wide. It's uh, one of the bigger... Points of contention. It is Union Artie, uh, but it doesn't look like the Union took any Artie, and I think that's actually wise. Then USA Spawn is down this road over here. So, uh, again, a very... Uh, Union is playing quite far back. Um, kind of a classic strategy here for the Union. Um, we will see how it works for them. The CSA, I think they were expecting more of a, def more of a defense forward in this position. But so far, they have not encountered any opposition. So off we go. Get Jeff Knight out here. Some recon, scoping out the uh, battlefield, letting uh, the lines know where the CSA is going. Always a good practice, especially if you're going to have kind of a Far hey, back defense. Uh, I could be doing some distance firing here. Draw line order. Mogabi, Mogabi, where are you? Oh, oh okay. I'm over there. Is it oh, Mugabi okay. or Mugatu? I'm retired. Let's put the smoke. Oh, you see the smoke over there. Mugatu. Yeah. Zoolander. Got to save the uh, president of Singapore, was it? So now that the uh, CSA has discovered there's no opposition on that side, they have moved the majority of their forces over. They still got one unit over here, although HD looks like the Rob might be moving over as well. So now they are kind of approaching the Union here, and you got the uh, 20th New York as a bit of the uh, tripwire force here, getting some initial shots off. I wouldn't hang out too long, though. The 42nd is actually going to come up and reinforce them. This is interesting. Um, we'll see if this works out for them. Got 8th PA over here as well. So you say taking their time, getting lined up. Massing their formation. Make sure you boys are utilizing hardcover. Hardcover. Direct north. Direct north. Direct north. Direct north. Direct north. 
It is a hard position here, but uh, again, the CSA can don't reload in the open and take it pretty easily if they want to. Some more reinforcements coming down here. It looks like uh, it's just the eighth PA, but they are getting some supporting fire. You got a IVB, fourth West Virginia, nineteenth Indiana, kind of all coming up here. So it looks like a uh, straight up uh, gunfight here. Looks like the Uni wants to make it a gunfight. We're also firing buck and ball. It's got a weird sort of egg shaped spread. Friendly's on the right, boys. Friendly's see how long the uh, CSA wants to hold this. Um, I guess they're happy right now to do the gunfight. Um, no, I died. You can keep it up for a bit. See how many casualties you're actually producing. See, it, it, it would basically a static line here. I mean, the Union has a bit of a secondary line behind here, uh, which I kind of like, um, to allow this Union force to kind of fall back if they need to. So it's a decent setup for the Union. Um, CSA, you know, basic, uh, relatively linear formation here, although they got some maneuvering going on in the back here, but it's a slugfest right now. Hey, so you say it's starting to pull up a little? Yeah, and me too. I fired two rounds at the little fucking cunt, and he's not dead. Dude, look at him just standing there. Oh wait, we got a charge. Go, 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 go. Uh, yeah, get shit on, officer. Come on, not, come on, come on. Right, come on. It's kind of straggly here. We'll see if the union. I think the union might be able to hold this. We'll see. It also has two different points of concentration. So. I'll watch this side of the fight here. Might be able to catch the other side, but I think the Union should be able to hold this. Yep, 19th Indiana is coming in for a good counterattack. I'm not sure about the other side, but we'll watch this one first. See what happens. Hold the flag, hold the flag, hold the flag. Hold the flag, hold the flag. Yep, good hold by the Union. Was not a very good charge by the CSA, to be honest with you. 
And I didn't watch it, but they uh, won on this side as well. So not a good attack by the CSA at all. Uh, we'll see if the Union wants to push up at all or if they're happy to kind of just uh, stay in their current positions. You still have a tiny element here. Get I would charge this out. Back, try to knock out the flag here if they're going to stay up here. Oh, they're going to... Are they pulling back or not? Pull back. Save the flags. Pull back. Save yeah, flags. good idea. Hold on a second. So they're not going to charge this element out. But the flags did pull back, which was a wise decision. Wait for the reinforcements and uh, figure out your next move. But um, good hold by the Union so far. I think it's funny. Move. move it up, move 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 up, PA moving back up to reinforce the 42nd over here in the 20th. Pull back, pull back, pull back, pull back, pull back. Pull back. Oh, they're going to pull back, kind of maintain the initial lines here. Um, these guys moved up quite far here. Oh, no, they're going to fall back. I think they figured out it was a little bit too late. I uh, yeah, I think it's they had a good positioning for that first one. I think it's uh, I think they're doing the right thing pulling back here. See Jeff Knight dealing with a random flag they got out there. Maxwell, do you have a on the line? See what the CSA wants to do next. Union's got a slight ticket advantage here. Uh, time is not great though. Not horrible, but not great either. So, so you see it's still in a very good position on this map here. You just need to do a little bit uh, more concentration on what your ob actual objective is and what you're trying to achieve and coordinating it. There is Steam Chat in this event, so. When in doubt, sprint it out. I can't wait at all these game ass game, game ass Oh, what's up, man? Is HL moving up? Let's see. Buffy. One tick right to right right back a little bit. And the CSA has capped. And again, it's a very wide cap zone. So it's not a bad idea to do so, especially uh, battle ready. So, again, you see how wide the cap zone is. See how the Union chooses to react to this. And they are going for an immediate counterattack, which I think is the right choice. Here comes IVB. is wiped out, but um, that was kind of a sacrificial maneuver here, because you see that's allowed the Union to kind of do a turning movement here, 
and have actually gotten onto the flank of the CSA. And this could be devastating to them. Shoot them, boys. Shoot them. So that was a good distraction by the IVB. Brace, brace, we'll see brace. if this was enough. Here they come. Brace it now. Brace it now. <laughs> Union is coming at a good angle, cutting off the retreat of the CSA. We'll see if it's enough. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Get the flag. Get the flag. Come on, you stupid okay, fucking reload, 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 reload. No, you are not getting away. And it looks like it was a good charge. I I, I, I liked it a lot. CSA was able to consolidate, though. Um, yeah, I think the main criticism I would have for it is I think it was a little bit too disaggregated. I think what happened was IVB going in a little bit too early. If that Either these guys had moved a little bit faster or if IVB delayed by like maybe 15 seconds, um, it would have been more effective. This is dog shit. You don't want to do this. NWB, don't do... Oh, it's already over, man. You, oh, you're just throwing away your uh, troops right now. You should know the charge is, is done. Again, you have Steam Chat, so I'm being a little bit more critical. If this was without Steam Chat, I'd be more... Uh, kill the rebel, kill the rebel inclined to excuse this, but, uh... Now, on the one hand, the Union can lose tickets right now without it being too big a deal, um, because they were ahead, but I'd still... You're wasting time is the main thing is of right now of going in with, you know, kind of a half ass charge like that. So, you know, this, if you waited like, you know, have, you know, 30 seconds for this to all go in together, um, be a much, you probably would have knocked him to down. back. Keep to the left, get off cap. Hit him on the front. Give it to him, boys, come on. We'll see, uh, the Union might be going for a last stand strategy. Um, with 16 minutes, um, it could work. It could absolutely work. Um, yeah, that's what they're going for. That's not a bad idea at all. Um, well, now they're starting to fall behind on tickets, but again, they'll get they'll get them back here if they take the point back. But again, this is a very disaggregated charge here. Union's starting to retake point here. I think they might have it. Yep, they did it. Uh, I mean, the cost a lot doing it, but um, yeah, they got it. The question is, how far do they pursue this? Yeah, I think this is They're running the main. They're running the main. Right here. Limit of advance. Limit of advance, how far you advance. It's a limit on your advance. So, you know, you don't carry the attack so far. You know, it's a, it's a method of controlling your formation. Of Okay, this is as far as we go. So you don't lose uh, cohesion. Like right now, I think this is way too far. Now, again, it could be that they're going for the... Um, the last stand option, but if that's the case, these guys back here need to get off a point. So if that's the strategy, you need to stop capping. Okay, and they stop capping. They're, yay. As long as they're not capping. Okay. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god, I killed a friendly. So yeah. Again, 14 minutes left to get the uh, two morale states down. I think that is certainly feasible for the Union. Um, and I think this could be a uh, could, could work out very well for them. We will see how the CSA they need to get organized and do some maneuvering as well. Um, you got you got some room. You don't need to go headfirst into them. You could do some maneuvering. You know, off to the left here I think is the best option. 
and try to, you know, the, this Union team is, is very spread out right now. You could very easily eat this Union team. Um, see, is, uh, what, what's, what's the plan here, though? Are we, are we going for the cap or are we not? You're working across purposes right now. You have people on the cap, but you've got other guys so far forward. Uh, I'm confused. I, I don't know. I can't... I don't know if that was a mistake or what that was, but now this Union element here is caught out here, and they are very vulnerable to getting counterattacked by the CSA. And they could do a ton of damage to them right now. So I, I I don't know what happened there with the union strategy. Uh, rally, 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 Stay together, boys. Stay with the team. I think they they had I think the union should have gone you know tried for the uh, the last stand. I think that would have been a far better strategy than recapping at this point. They you know 14 minutes they had a, an infinite you know a very long time. You know, next time it's going to be on the recap. It's going to be at a uh, seven minute, which is still possible. But um, not super easy. So now here comes the CSA. They are kind of moving a little slow here, um, but they are getting their flags back and the kind of maneuvering. So Union looks like they're resetting to their earlier defensive positions, which worked out very well for them. So. We'll see. I'll be curious if the CSA is going to go for a, a cap or if they're going to try to push them off again. I think they should try to push them off. I know it's going to be tough. You just need to do a bit of a better attack. Just a little bit more concentrated. Um, figure out your objective. Like, I would I would say the objective is this point right here. Have one element, you know, have half your team come up on one side, half the team come up on the other, and have one force over here as your blocking element. To uh, protect your flank, and that's that's how I would do this attack. You don't need to go too far; just eat that and consolidate, and then you know go to the next objective. You don't need to eat the whole thing all at once. That's the hard point for the Union. I think you take this position from the Union, and you can, you know, you hold it because they'll probably counterattack you, and you'll be in excellent shape if you can hold that. But we will see. For the Union, I I, I don't think I'd change anything right now. And, you know, I think this uh, defensive setup here where they got kind of this advance on the left and kind of this reserve on the right is, is working quite well for them so far. One man spacing. Great line, boys. Great line. Left a knife for Andy Berg. Uh, yep, so even out on, uh, players, which is good to see. And there we go. Union not taking losses now, so one more morale state in 28 minutes. So the CSA might not even want to attack. They might want to just shoot it out for a bit, uh, which is certainly an option for them. Especially if the Union is going to stay within gun range. Watch friendlies. Comes ninth core. Same thing. Open order. Same thing, boys. Same spots. Board in line, boys. Hey, Kentucky, back here. Kentucky, too far. Extend out. Extend out. Extend out. That was a form the line, boys. He's good. Thank you. Who's on our right oblique? I have been fighting for getting my voice back for like half an hour by now. I'm so fed up. Yeah, now this is a little bit too much here on this side here. I don't I want to do the attack now. Now I would probably strike out against this IVB back in reserve. Yeah, I'd, I'd try to maneuver up towards IVB, which is not easy, but uh, 
Yeah, that's a little bit too much on the Union side over there. Now this is now this is kind of the weakness side. That's bad, Tiger. Don't do that. Pancake, you look nice there, man. Thank you. Pancake, the best flag bear. You look mighty dapper, sir. And the Union's gotten him down to taking losses. Check. 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 Are they inching a cap? We'll see. There you go. Indiana doing a nice little sneak volley there. This is coming all the way over here. It is a very delicate Cash. So Wilkes is all the uh, way over here. Me? And again, I would, I would, um, you know, the space is here. You know, you've got this HDC, HDC, HD skirmish element here. Um, Wilkes could, if he wanted to, maneuver out to the left, circumvent the point, and pop up here, you know, behind on IVB's uh, right flank. I think he'd be in a very good position to uh, A, hurt them, and then, you know, if there's a move on point to turn and be an intercept force to block any allied attack towards the point. Allied attack. Any Union attack. Hey, move up! Move up! Move up! No worries, brother. No worries, pain. Move it! Move it! Move it! Left, 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 yeah, you're shooting at them. Yeah, you're shooting at 40 seconds. I think. Yes, sir. Since HL back over here, who was over on this side? Oh, you moved back? I pulled the rear. No, I mean, yeah, you want to be together, I guess, if you want to do an attack, but uh, I think that would have been a good flanking opportunity for you. And uh, CSA's got a good amount of time right now, so we'll see how long they want to maintain this for. I don't know if it's going to be quite enough, but it might be. Enter left, dress right, enter left, dress right, enter left, dress right, enter left, dress right. Watch for your friendlies, boys. We have friendlies just to the cross. We lost Rob. Good work. Oh, well. Oh my god, that was a good one. I think, I think we all shot at the same place. Woo! Fuck. 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 <laughs> god damn. Keep it steady for a second, steady. Hold it. Take aim! Take aim! Take aim! Take aim, Fortis Tech. Check. 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 What's going on? There's a flag behind the tree, kind of left over Zeke. We have some. Yep, that one's talking about shit. More to the left. Check. Yes. Down that line. Check the right. Sorry. Alright. Take aim! 
Oh shit. Oh, we got some movement. Yep. Oh shit, left. Oh shit. And it is on this side here. HD is kind of out front. Hey, they're here, they're here, they're here. They're here, they're here. They're here. Base, base, base. And they come in. I like this attack a lot better. Kind of going in like I thought. Now the problem is, where's the blocking force to stop this? If you don't do that, these guys are going to come in. Yep. So it was missing the blocking force. And here comes Sebi along with Knights. And they're going to try to close the door on this. We'll see if it's enough. They might have. Uh... Good shit, good shit. I like the way you die, boy. Yeah, the only criticism I would have was it was, that it was missing a blocking force to, to delay the IVB. But um, it still might be enough. By yourself, bro. You're going to die. Bye bye. Well. No, IVB, I think, is going to clean it up. We'll see. There's, there's a decent element up here. Knight's with them, too. they got to try to clean up what's left of this, but they've already lost a lot of power here. It's a good counterattack by a uh, counterblow by Knight, and uh, I think 4th West Virginia was in there as well, and then uh, IVB. You see there, they're going to clean it up. But, again, now they're almost at breaking here. The CSA should be making a rush for point right now. With this element here, they should be rushing point right now. Oh man, and try to precap it. Man, just rush everything forward here. And just send a small element to cap. And you, oh, these guys right here, who's this? Oh, you guys should be freaking precapping like a motherfucker right now. Just slide on over and precap. And these guys launch a main attack. Again, there's Steam Chat, so they should know this. If this, these guys launch a main attack, they'll lose, but they'll probably get them onto breaking, and if these guys might be able to sneak it in there and cap it. Um, but I think they lost a window, because now, yeah, there's too much Union coming back. That window's gone. It's an opportunity. It was risky, but I, I think it might have worked, you know. They, you know, the safer option is just to reset and, and get them down, shoot them down to breaking and possibly last stand. But now the Union is going to retreat to their main. So this element needs to attack now before they retreat. So these guys are making a big mistake waiting to get all their manpower. They need to attack now before the Union gets back to their spawn. Um, so we'll see if the CSA does that. I think they're going to sit back and wait, though. Yep. Big mistake. Big mistake. So now the Union is going to come back here and uh, kind of hang out behind their spawn. Although, you, this attack forward, man. There's all these stragglers here you could eat. Now nah, you're waiting to get all your big men here. Oh, there's nothing in front of us. Eh, you know. Like, eat this, man. Just attack into this, man, with these guys. Just attack into it. Get these couple out of lines. You don't want to cap right... I mean, you want a free cap, but you don't want to cap. So, you know. Way too long for the CSA to get that attack moving forward. I know you were disorganized, but so was the enemy, man. You had a great opportunity there. And again, you still got these onesies and twosies out here. You can eat these guys up here, man. Get some fucking uh, good tickets. You know, ten tickets. You might win. But again, you're fucking moving slow as shit. Probably hide in spawn. I'm star, boys. Anyone remember that Shrek is love poem? Oh, I do. Shoulder to shoulder. Find a gap, cover it up. 
TSA needs to be careful not to cap right now. Get off, get off, get off. HD needs to stay off. So there was an opportunity there for the CSA, I think, to get them onto uh, braking. But again, they moved way too slow, and they let the opportunity slip. Got to pay attention to the clock and think about what the enemy's going to be doing. This is a very clear move as to what they would want to do. Now, this is kind of the default option here. So, you know, you sat back and let it happen. So I, I really don't have much sympathy for this, this team right now. For the Union, um... You can just kind of hang back here and wait. You know, it's it's turtling, but you know. See, now this is turtling. Now there's no rule against it. You know, we could talk about it, but you know, if we, if we want a clear example, of what this is. You know, now you guys move up. Way too fucking late. Way too fucking late. You had all these out. You know, ones and twos, these out of lines. You could have gotten, but you stepped back here and took your shots. So close. So close. No, oh, didn't look at the didn't look at it. Didn't think. Yep, that's the limit. That's as far as they can go. Capping again. Off cap. Hey, union boy. I'm sure we're not capping. Your girlfriend looks like my mama. Wait, 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 wait. Bring it to me. Bring it to me. Fuck it. Bring it to me. On the line, boys. Are right you on this line, boys? Oh, I Push it on. Move up on the line. Sit tight. Hey, Dal, move up. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Quick snap, quick snap. Hey. There they go. Let's go. Go, 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 boys. Those are all over there. How you get the flag all the way down that low? Is that just what it does when you go when you get low? Low? I, I have no idea. I'm, I can't see it doing that on my screen. You had it all the way down in the dirt. That was cool as shit. How far can the CSA come up on this side? I think it stops right about here. Still, it's a better angle. Still can't really see him though. We're out of bounds. Yep, right there apparently. Moving south. I can see him. We can take a shot out to the corner. Come out here and fight like so how do we define turtling? We define turtling as the entire team moving to a position which cannot be engaged by direct means. Either rifle fire or bayonet by the other team. That is the de definition of turtling that I think uh, that I go with. And you can see it in operation here. Nolan, why? Now, can the CSA engage them with fire? We'll see. They need about maybe 15, 20 tickets here in the next 12 minutes. Yeah, 
Now, the CSA can recap here, but it, it's really tough because the Union will go for a last stand at that point. Um... I mean, which is tough, you know, it's 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 tough. But again, the CSA had an opportunity to get them on last on on uh, breaking. They they kind of this element out here just sat there plinking further than going in. When there's all these out of lines, you know, those guys that were down here waiting to get all their men together could have charged forward. They would have they would have all died, but you would have gotten them on breaking. So they were options. You know. I really wanted to cheat, you know, I could have my guys spawn on the other team and die out of line. You know. Kind of against the spirit of the game, but um You know. What is the spirit of the game? What's even the point of turtling? They're gonna lose in ten minutes anyway. I can see him moving to the trees up there. No, see they won't lose in ten minutes because you still have to cap and that puts on the seven minute recap timer. Are there anti-turtling rules? Well, we, we didn't come to a definition of what turtling is. Again, I would say my definition of moving the entire team to a location that cannot be engaged by direct or indirect means by the enemy team is turtling. Is this impossible to engage with direct or indirect means? Well, we'll see. What do I mean by direct or direct indirect means? I'm referring to fires, but just think about it. Can I kill the enemy? If I have no means to kill the enemy, either through RD, bayonet, or rifle fire, then I have no ability to, you know, hit them. So even if I can't hit them with rifle fire, if I can't reach them with a bayonet, if I can hit them with rifle fire, it's okay. If I can't hit them with rifle fire, can I hit them with the RD? Then it's okay. If I have no options, zero options, then it's turtling. And if it's the whole team, as it is here. So, if you want to have a discussion on turtling, this is my definition. You guys let me know what your definition is in the comments. Now again, CSA, you had some options. I, I pointed them out. I'm not going to point them out again, but um, so part of this is your fault for letting them do this. Right now, come on up. We're just sitting here doing nothing. At least let us be curious. Why is there a rainbow flag hanging out there? Don't do nothing at all, boys. This rock. Let's get as much fire as we can going up this hill. Oh, they're fired back! What are we shooting at? So, yeah, again, if I wanted to be cheeky, I'd have guys. Yeah, that kind of breaks the event. But the question is does this break the event?
Check. Yeah, this game's kind of wonky Check. at times. This terrain looks like the freaking devil's Check. den. Reminds me of our old games we did play in the back. Hey, Biscuit. Let's go for a fire. I can't see shit through this sun. Fire fast, fire fast. Unfair. Um. Is it unfair? Well, we can even get there. Like, yep. Brief today, boys. I would say it's unsportsmanlike. So this is, a victory. is it unfair? Yeah. Comes down to a matter of opinion, in my opinion. I think it I think it is unsportsmanlike and um is my view of this type of tactic. Is it against the world? No. Can it be valid? Yeah. Could be. Depending on the type of fan I'm doing. And again, the union didn't go until they were very close to uh taking losses. It wasn't like they did this very early, so all right, so the CSA is going to come back here and cap. Now they need to get their troops into a position to do so. So the CSA has kind of fucked up already. They probably just got tired, though, of not having their troops in position to receive this charge before. Um, they probably got enough time to set it up, though. But, um, so yeah, here we go. But after approximately 10 minutes of shooting, needing about, I'd say, 15 to 20 tickets... They were not able to achieve that, so with basically the whole CSA line pouring fire into that position, I think that's fairly uh, indicative of whether or not that area can be engaged by enemy fires, direct or indirect. There's no indirect fires here, and just rifles and bayonets. So. See, this is a, already a, a not a good... All these guys are going to do is get eaten here. I don't know why you're out front by yourselves like this. I guess maybe as a tripwire, but it's, it's, there's no point. You're just going to get swallowed and not be there for the main attack. And in fact, the entire CSA team here is... I mean, you got PB out here as well. They're by themselves. They're just going to get eaten. Not a good setup for defense. Treat them like dodos. <laughs> Treat them like Again, I can see why the CSA would be kind of pissed off going into this, but, uh, you know. Oh, look, there's a dead coward. Now this Union charge is kind of running out of steam, to be honest with you. Did they lose some people? I think that was because of a... Uh, it looks like it was a counter charge by the NYV into their flank has really uh, cut the legs out from that charge here. But they need to make sure Union doesn't cap right now. I mean, I suppose they could let them and just let it go to breaking. Um, that's also an option. Um, straight to the south in the road. Yeah, I don't know what quite happened on that Union charge there. It should have been more effective. Yeah, now IVB going in. MW. Yeah, this is a shit charge here. Come here, you fucking yeah. right. CSA still might win this, actually. They might put the Union on to uh, final push here in a moment. So now I would hang back a little bit and get, get a defensive line set um, and receive the next Union charge, and that'll put them on to final push.
piece of shit. Don't kill me. Coward ass motherfucker. Load fucking ball. You fucking ball. Again, not a, uh, here comes 42nd, but again, not a good charge here. It is too spread out. It is not well supported. All these cowards. There's the final push. Two minutes forty remaining. So again, it's a wide, um, can't you know, cap zone. So the union doesn't have to charge in. Now you can come in here and try to cap from this angle here. Now they do have unlimited tickets, so maybe they think it that way. But again, these are really not good charges. You can see how spread out they are, and they have just been uh, getting eaten alive here by this much more consolidated. Now this is a much better line than the one was before. Um, but it is vulnerable to attack on the sides here. So, like where, um, yeah, these guys from IVB. How many officers do they have? I think it's just the RD officers. Yeah, they just took the RD officer slots. That's fine. I was the storm. I was like, what? Oh, no, no. Okay, RD officers. They do have RD. Uh, makes sense. So this is this is a bit better here. Occupy this, but this. There you go. There you go. You're learning. Now the CSA has to charge you out. Let them take point, they'll go to last stand. Um, no, they won't. They'll go up to breaking. They go to whatever level you're at. at the, they, they, they even out at your line is what happens here. Um, a bit of a better charge here coming in from two angles here. Time for distraction on this side here. And then a main attack going down this angle. This is working a little bit better for them. Kill the French, Markham! Southwest behind you! Really, the NYV needs to, to turn here. Brace right! Head is brace right! They're in us! Brace right! Gentlemen, up the hill! Up the hill, they are charging Hold us. Here. Hold here. They are charging us from up the hill. We are getting charged. Are you wearing this? Oh, 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 team kill. Here comes Union again. Twenty seconds remaining. They might still get the CSA on the last uh, last stand here in a moment. You are Hampton's lead, young man. kill these Wake up! Come, boys. Lead me to the slaughter, gentlemen. Stay. Stay more, guys. Stay more. There we go. Hold the line. Hold the line. Do not zoo, zoo, zoo. Nice job. There it is. And CSA has still uh, carried out a win there, despite the uh, turtling by the Union. So. There's that. It can work, but then you still got to do good charges, you know. So we got one more to go. We'll see how it goes. I think it's a uh, bloody lane, so. The Union attack. will give them a chance to be on the attack on this one. Nothing. God, a few, three, four guys got shot, maybe. 